Hello, yes, good afternoon. Good afternoon, ma. What is your name? My name is Maricel Umali. Maricel, how old are you? I'm 37 years old. Single or married? Separated, ma. How many years separated? I think it's three, more than three years. More than three years. You have how many kids? Three kids, ma'am. How old is the youngest one? Seven. So who will gonna take good care of them if you go to abroad? My mother. How old is she? She is 62. Still capable? Yes, ma'am. You worked before in Hong Kong? Yes, okay. ma'am. In what year? I started, the first employer I've started is October 26, 2014, but until, until what? Until January because 2015. I got 2015. Yes, 2015. In where? In where? In Hong Kong? It is on Mount Shan. How many members of the family? They are three. How old is the kid? She's only two years old. Mm. And your mom is working before? Yes, ma'am. Both of them are working? Yes, ma'am. So in the morning, would you mind to tell me your duties with this one year old? Hey, with this, yeah, uh, one year old? Hey, two year old. Two sorry. year old. Tell me your duties. First in the morning, I prepare a hot water for her because I need to change diaper for her because she on the time she need to go to school already. Mm -mm. And then after that, uh, I, I need to change clothes, her uniform, and I need to make a milk before she go to the school. Then after that, I need to tie her hair, everything dressed up, and bring her downstairs to for waiting the bus. Mm. So every day this is your routine? Yes, ma'am. You cook dinner? Yes, ma'am. So you work for one year? Yes. And um, the reason is that about because you, you got some uh, allergy skin allergy yes, okay but after that 2015 to 2017 you went back in Hong Kong in Taiwan yes ma'am you took care of how many kids the two girls how old are they five and seven mom is working yes ma'am mm. and are you the one who goes to market most of the time no no how about cooking cooking I'm the one who cooking for dinner Okay, would you mind to tell me what food you can cook for dinner? I can cook a steamed fish, a sweet and sour pork, and uh, my first girl, she loved the tomato with egg, mm -hmm. and the second one, she loved the chicken wings. Mm -hmm. Okay, <laughs> do you cook soup? Yes, ma'am. I see. You went also in Singapore, right? Mm. You worked for three years? Yes, ma'am. In one employer? Yes. You took care of three kids? Yes, ma'am. How old are they? Seven, nine, and fifteen on the time when I, I started them. How big is the house in Singapore? It's two-story house. Are you the only one helper? Yes, ma'am. Mm, mom is working? Yes, ma'am. I see. So, based on your experience, you work for Chinese and Singaporean almost same. Yes. That um, they really want to eat delicious foods. Do you think you have the skill in cooking? Mm. Just be honest. I want to be honest, really. My cooking is, if I need to grade it up, it's only number seven. But okay. I, but I need, I'm willing to learn and follow the instruction and also the cooking book. Mm. And you got the reference letter from your previous employer, right? Yes, ma'am. And I think they said here that during her employment with us, her performance is up to our satisfactory level, such as cooking, take care of children, and house management. Mm, thank you so much for letting me read your yes, no. release letter. Okay. Now in Hong Kong, you know that your day off. Um, sometimes they will not give you Sunday, and sometimes they won't let you go out, but they will pay you money. It's and funny. share room with the other members of the family, not with sir, of course, yes, of but course with not. the kids maybe, okay? It's fine. Are you willing to grab that opportunity? Yes, ma'am. So you are not able to take good care of pets because yes, you have really don't yeah, want. skin allergy, but you can cook everything, you can eat everything, right? No. There is there, an, there is there food that you cannot eat? Yes, ma'am. I Which got food? An seafood allergies. Seafood. Oh, never yes, mind. Because not every day you cook seafood. Okay. So probably fish is okay. Yes. Fish okay. is only the one. It's okay from the regarding on the seafoods. I see. Okay. Now, uh, you also familiar that in Hong Kong the house are small. Yes. Okay. In, is it in Singapore the house is small or big? 
cost of the house are there very big. Very big. So I'm afraid you are not get used to work in a small house. Do you think you are easy to adopt? Small or big house? Small, of course, mom. You like small? Yes. How about if the employee give you a big house? Will you accept that? I think I need to make a timetable for myself. So That's I, good. So I can arrange properly what I need to do and which one the second priority that I need to do after the first priority, especially if I'm the one who's taking care of the ch children. Do you think you can assist the kids in doing their homework? Yes, because I used to do. You used to do that? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So if you will gonna take good care of, let's say, um, uh, around four or so four to seven or eight years old, they are very naughty, right? They are used to be. If they are fighting, how could you stop them? I need to talk to them nicely. How about if they don't listen to you? I need to make a promise for them. Like what? If you never, if you will stop fighting tomorrow, we will go into play one by one. I can play for, let's say, for the Coco, and the second one is the youngest one. Then after that, then I will make promise, right? Then I will talk to them. If you never follow me next time, I will not play with you. Oh, so you make some tricks to, yes, for them to listen to you, right? Yes. And you know how to give some initiative in taking care of manage or managing the attitude of the kids, yes, right? So you have the big confidence mm -hmm. that you can take good care of naughty children. Yes, ma'am. Two kids. Are, are you okay? Two kids. Two kids, ma'am. Okay. You can handle. Yeah. Okay. Tell me your message to your future employer. To my sir and my mom, I hope you will give me a chance to look after your kids. Uh, I can guarantee to you that I will treat your kids as my own kids and I will be them as their own friends, especially if they really need someone to play or someone who can help them in their homework and someone they can assist me everything they needed if you're not around with us. And hopefully you will trust me. And I hope you like you like me to choose as your own helper man. Thank you. Thank you. See you in Hong Kong. See you. Bye bye. Bye bye.